friends welcome back in Tassib we need to know some basics about geometry let's go and learn them here I have some different forms of chance sketching the main difference is the size of Vagira in each one I mean in their angle I sketch one fourth of a circle in this one and I will repeat it four times to have a complete piece. In this one, I have one sixteenth of a circle and I need to repeat 16 times to make a finished one. This one is much smaller, I mean one thirty twos of a circle and I should be so careful when I want to repeat it. To start, you need to go to your compass box. We will need angle bisector and perpendicular bisector, which I already made videos about. You should have a surrounding circle, which is the final size of your right artwork. I mean, all of your motifs will be inside this circle. I need a straight line which goes through the center of my circle. Now I have two points and I will put my point of my compass in each point and I'm gonna make two curves here and I will repeat it on the other point. Now. I have two dots at the intersection of them. If I connect these arcs using my ruler, it is going to pass the center and now I have one fourth of my Shams artwork. Like so. And this angle is exactly 90 degrees. If I want a smaller angles, I need to repeat this process. This round pattern in Tazi is called Shamse. It is the symbol of sun. I'm trying to teach how to make one of these in this and further videos. To sketch it, we need to make one small part and then repeat it in the whole circle. Each part is called Vagire. The smaller your Vagira angle is, the more details you need to make in your final artwork. Keep in mind, even one millimeter error in one eighth of your sketching will end up eight millimeter errors at final work, which is a terrible mistake in a detailed piece. So let's practice how to play it safe. As you all know, practice makes perfect and the good news is you can share your sketches with me. I will include my email address in the description portion of this video. You can also see the process of making artworks and also finished ones on my Instagram page. I'm making more videos about this beautiful art and I'm trying to teach all of the points and techniques. So please subscribe if you want to learn more. And this would be 132s of a Shams artwork. You can repeat this process as much as you want and have smaller and smaller angles. This is the final one.
this angle is 11.25 degrees. I hope you enjoyed this one. See you soon.